Hey YouTube, this is King Beast. I'm here coming at you with another video. And what I have for you today is One Piece Chapter 3. So without further ado, let's get into this chapter. Good old One Piece, you know, you can never beat it. Chapter 3. Enter Zolo the Pirate Hunter. So first off, the chapter leaves off where we left off from Chapter 2. Kobe and Luffy are sailing from a dinghy they got from Alvita's hideout on a, hideout on a certain island. Um, they're talking about Zoro. And Kobe explains Zoro as a... He's like a bloodthirsty hound, so he's like a demonic beast. He's this guy that you're not supposed to mess with. He'll kill you. He's a, he's a beast. So... They arrive at the naval base. It has the marine town. Let me give you an overall view of the marine base. So, it's a town. Just imagine looking at a town. There's buildings, just the standard buildings. And then at the very, very top, there's a marine with a flag and a marine base set, set, um, set up there. So, now I'll give you an overall view. They just arrived there. And Kobe got Luffy and himself to the destination because Kobe knows a little navigation. Of course, Luffy doesn't, so that's a big, big problem. And Luffy says he has to get himself a navigator. Hint, hint. <clears throat> and then Luffy and Kobe go to a food restaurant. They walk through the town and go to a food restaurant. And then they start eating there, and then Luffy mentions Robo Noah's all those names, and everybody just goes like that. So, yeah. And then whenever Kobe mentioned Captain Morgan's name, everybody did the same thing. So, yeah, they're, they're all scared of those two guys. So. so, Luffy and Kobe get done eating. They walk out of the restaurant. And, um... Uh, of course, Kobe doesn't understand why they flipped whenever they heard the Captain Morgan's name. Well, Kobe right. See, in a, in a few pages. So they go to where Ro Noah's oil is. He's heard that he's tied somewhere, so they're gonna go. So now at the Marine Naval Base Tower I was talking about, now they're at that, they walk through the town, they walked up, and now they're at a gate. So of course Luffy climbs over it and sees Ro and Noah's Zolo sitting there tied up in the middle of almost nowhere. Well it's not in the middle of nowhere, it's just a big kind of a decent midfield between do you know, like, an entrance to a castle, like, how there's, like, a fence, and then, like, the thing flips up and then goes down, and then there's, like, like, yardage, or, like, how you're entering a mansion, there we go, that's how you put it, you know how you're entering a mansion, and there's, like, that space between the house and the gate, it's kind of like that. So, he's there, and Kobe's like, Doofy, don't go in there, that's suicide, but Zora's like, come and untie me. And of course, Kobe's like, don't do it, Luffy. And then, of course, they... Luffy's like, he'll kill us. He's like, of course he can't. I won't let him. And Kobe's like, you're dumb. And then a little girl pops up. He's like, boop. So she's like, shh. And she goes, she um flips over the thing. She goes walking up to Zoro. And she gives him rice balls. But they're not the traditional rice balls that are made with salt. No, she made them with sugar. And she tries to give him the Zoro. He wanted her to get out of there, but now, coming from the gate, is Helmentho, Captain Morgan's son. You know how big of a jerk he is. Goes up to the little girl and says, he thought the rice balls were him. He takes a bite, he's like, ugh. He throws them on the ground and starts stomping on them. And she worked really hard to make them. And of course, Kobe's like, how diabolical was that? And she starts crying. It, it, it's sad. And, co and of course, Helen Manfred points out the sign. He's, he's like, so you see here, it's your own fault. Can you read the sign? It says, anyone aiding the prisoner shall be found guilty of the crimes he has committed. Captain Morgan. So he reads out his dad's thing about her. And he tells the naval officer, throw that girl over the gate. And he's, he's like, okay. And just, and of course, Luffy catches her, of course. As she's going, th like, as she's flying, Luffy like, and it does like a dive thing. Whoops, I showed the thingy. Nah, it's alright, I didn't show any panels, or... Heh. 
Mummy, I showed like the front cover. I don't think I'll get copyrighted for that. It's just the cover. What, what could go wrong with anyway? No, not to worry. I'll cover up with like a sticker or something. Um. And after that, Luffy catches her and like, you okay, little girl? Like, of course, Kobe and them are still there, and she's a girl. And of course, Hella Mempho didn't see Luffy. They, him and the two officers walk away. Then, then Luffy comes over. And then Luffy's thinking about Zolo joining his pirate crew. And of course, Luffy tells him, You got a bad reputation. He's like, Bad reputation? Well, anyway, I don't go for that kind of deal. I got my own plans for the future. I don't need your help. I can get out of here on my own. So he's like, Get out of here on my own. And then, like, Zoro's like, Give me those rice balls on the ground. He's, he's like, okay, the rest of the door. Also, he gives, Luffy gives him the Zoro. He ate him. He's like, tell the girl that made these this was delicious. Of course, Luffy and Kobe go back to the village. And they say that Zoro said that this, the, her rice balls were delicious. And she said that, hell, a couple of dogs, Halamenfo's dogs were hunting her down in a flashback. And that Zoro protected her from it. And then, of course... Halamenfo was going to keep his promise to Zola by at the end of the month if he were to, to survive, he'd get out of there. But Halamenfo made a joke about it. He said he's going to be executed in three days. So my man's Luffy just goes up and just whacks the freaking guy in the face. And actually did the exact motion he did. He actually did something like that. So, yeah. And of course, Kobe's grabbing Luffy. He's like, Luffy, calm down. It's... He's like, Kobe, I made my decision. I'm going to Azalea to do my close. So that is it for chapter 3, you know, it's a rather sh kind of short chapter. I wouldn't say you had that short, but, you know, that's all. So let me know what you thought of this video. Hit the like button if you liked it. Hit the dislike button if you disliked it. Hit the subscribe button for more content like this. And hit that gray bell to be notified when I make a new video. I am signing out.